just at my house like a week ago trying to make me promote a clothing brand. Oh, he's talking about me. Stop it. Put your away, my boy. This man was in the shower with his like he really, he really went in the shower, started this. You got your d out, homie, in the shower. What you got? It's what? What is this? And then it says, if you still had animosity after the fight you lost, you should have never been cool with me again, fam. I'm gonna be honest. I have no animosity towards you at all, my boy. You know what I'm saying? This happened years ago. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna let you know something, buddy. You're not like that. I invest, I invest over 100K in four months on my- What the f does this have to do with anything? You don't know what side to pick on. It ain't about no sides. You wanna talk about sides? This shit is about real shit. You're fucked up actions. Now you're in the shower with your dick out. Spazzing, you're screaming at the camera. What has gotten into you? Hey man, say man, it's your boy, Simone. Back with another video, man. And in today's video, we are reacting to Sid's response to everything. Now, luckily, I found this video on YouTube. You know what I'm saying? This person, they, they clipped everything from what Sid was saying on Instagram, apparently, and everything like that. So we're going to watch it. We're going to tune in. I'm going to give y'all my, my response, my side. And shit, we gonna get into it, you know what I'm saying? I'ma just get straight into it, you dig? Let me see. Any reason to talk? Cause you niggas got past and you niggas wanna catch back up. Don't do that, dry ass, hating ass. He was just at my house, like, a week ago, trying to make me promote a clothing brand. Nigga like, what the f***? Come on, bruh. Stop all that f***ing sucking. You niggas don't know what side to pick on. The Wait, hold on. Is this nigga talking in the shower with his dick out? If you make the whole side, you can stay. Wait, huh? You mean to tell me this man went on Instagram, grabbed his phone, recorded himself in the shower with his dick out, and started dissing? What? This man was in the shower with his. This man went in the shower with his. Uh, make it make sense. Like he really, he really went in the shower. Started this? You got your dick out, homie? It's what? What is this? Stay on that side. That's why I ain't crossing back and forth. Ain't my shit. I'ma stay here. Then on top of that, it's like nothing I do is okay, bro. I go to staying quiet, not saying nothing, cause I'm just I'm just letting them talk, cause I know what's up. Oh, you guilty as? Why you not responding to them? You guilty for having your, your dick out in the shower? That's 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 one thing for sure. You know what I'm saying? Now, right here, I, I'm assuming he's talking about me because I, I hear him say, um, you just came to my house a week ago, whatever. Yeah, I came to Sid's house about a week and a half ago, maybe two weeks ago, to drop off some Play Benchy merch. If y'all don't know, I have a homeboy that does um, clothing, Play Benchy, a fashion designer and shit like that. So he does clothes. He was just like, yo, I want to get Sid in my shit too. So I was just like, all right, bet, I got you. So I told Sid, I said, hey, let me pull up. You know what I'm saying? I dropped these clothes off for you. You know what I'm saying? I know Sid going on tour and shit. So I'm like, shit, let me bring him this drip. You know what I'm saying? I went over the crib for like five minutes. I literally came, dropped the clothes, took a video from my boy, and bumped out. You dig what I'm saying? So I wasn't, I wasn't at your crib chilling with you. I didn't smoke no thoint with you, no joint with you, no motherfucking like, no, I ain't do none of that. I ain't kick it. I ain't do nothing like that. You know what I'm saying? Not saying I couldn't have kicked it, but I'm just saying, like, he, he kind of making it seem like I was in the crib, just, I came out kicking it with niggas, and I was up, what's up, my nigga, you did what I'm saying? Like, no, hell no, I wasn't in that bitch doing none of that, you know what I'm saying? I came, I dropped the clothes, and I said, uh, I'm gonna fuck with you, stay up, my G, you know what I'm saying? So, but that's until I found out this whole shit, you know what I'm saying? Whole time, I'm looking out for niggas and shit like that. Whole time, you telling editors not to edit for me when we was cool, you know what I'm saying? You you doing this to this person, that person, this person, that person. It's a it's it's a count. I can't even put it on my goddamn fingers. I can't even count it. I go to apologizing, apologizing. I ain't apologizing to them. I'm not apologizing to no that are making me try to get. See, that's his problem. That's that's the whole point. He's he, like, why is your pride so high, my boy? Like, like. 
fam, you know you, you did this shit. Like, look yourself in the mirror. You know what I'm saying? I just, you, in the, you in the bathroom already, goddamn. You in the shower. You finna walk out that bitch butt-ass nigga. You know what I'm saying? Look at yourself in the mirror and just, just really look at yourself and, and just really say, like, bro, just admit the fact, like, bro, you did this shit, bro. You did it to me. You did it to the, you, you did You know what I'm saying? Like, that's the thing. He, his, I, I remember he used to say, Geo pride too high. Geo, my pride ain't high. You know what I'm saying? Like I'll put my pride aside for certain shit. You know what I'm saying? This, like, put your pride aside, my boy. You know what I'm saying? Like, apologize to everybody. You know what I'm saying? Even, I even texted bro. You know what I'm saying? When, when I found out this whole information about this slimy activity, I hit his phone. I'm like, bro. And then he was continue to cap. Like, why are you continuing to cap? I, I don't get it. When your birthday, I'm gonna give you a cap for your birthday, my boy. Customized. Cancel that's posting shit about me that's not true. So I go to apologizing to y'all for what they said. I'm not trying to make y'all think I'm that person. I apologize to y'all. Why are you apologizing to us? Come on, bro. Then I go to post a receipt. Now some of y'all think something. You apologize because your views drop. That's the only reason. King Sid apologize. That's the only reason why you 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 apologize, my boy, because your views was dropping. Fucking ass niggas like, why the fuck you posting this? Is too much info. This and that, nigga. What the fuck, bitch? I wanna know this shit. The fuck? God damn. Shit. I'm like, why why is bruh screaming at the phone in the shower? What? What is dick out? Okay. Now I'll tell y'all who's having a fucked up Thanksgiving though. King uh -huh. shit. Now King shit has been going literally crazy on I his see Instagram. That. I mean, like more than usual though. Like he looks like he's off them, off them exos. Like he's really like bugging out on Instagram right now, and he's been going after everybody who's made an exposed video on him. King Kenzie, uh, Smooth Geo, Nate. Uh, he went. He even got Suave. Literally anybody who's made a video on him, he's tried to retort. He's mad. So, so this video right here, for those y'all that don't know, um, Sid dropped the my side of the story video. You know what I'm saying? But he deleted it. You know what I'm saying? Y'all, the comments was ballistic. I can't even say crazy. I gotta say ballistic. The comments on this video was very ballistic. They was on that ass. And he deleted the response video. He was really talking about bullshit. You know what I'm saying? We, we go, let's see if they play it right now. Because he lost 25,000 subscribers because of all of this drama. And he's literally just going on a rampage on anybody who's trying to tarnish his image. Which is literally everybody. So I ain't gonna lie. too many people, dog. Without further ado, I mean, let's just really get straight into it. I gotta record from my own iPhone. So 3, 2, 1, go. And we recording... Now, the first post, we just going to go post by post, y'all. And this might be a long video because I'm going to try and, like, explain it. But first post, y'all want me to apologize to who? To Nate, who lied about so much stuff? Hold on, let me read this, and then I'm going to skip past it. So he basically wrote a message to everyone. It says, Nate, Kala Kid, me, Lil Jeff, Diamond, Kenzie, Flex God, and, yeah, I think that's it. But he said to Nate. To Nate who lied about so much shit, the man telling y'all he paid $1,200 for rent each month and ain't tell y'all I was paying $2,500. The total amount each month was $8,500. There was five people in the house, six including me. Do the fuck... Oh. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? He said, do the effing math. Uh, five times $1,200 is $6,000. So why he ain't tell y'all I was paying more than all them... And plus, the shit was under my name without my credit. We couldn't even be able to stay there. And the man saying I hit a girl, blah, blah, blah. Bro, this, this is not even addressing the shit that's been going on, fam. The shit that's been going on, you slamming niggas out. You, you hitting on girls, you know what I'm saying? You just moving weird, you moving crazy. You know what I'm saying? And fam, he's going off about... He paid more on the rent than Nate and all them fam. You are King Sid. You're King Sid. You're supposed to be a boss. You know what I'm saying? You have the master bedroom. You're supposed to pay at least a little more. You know what I'm saying? Like, of course, my boy. You're talking about unnecessary shit. Shit that don't even make sense. 
This shit has nothing to do with anything. Let me continue. Then, Gio, you're definitely bull. Hey, you got me fucked up, twin. They said, Gio, you're definitely bull. You listened to an editor and tried to run off with anything to hop on the hate train. Bro, I, I didn't, bro, I, like I said, I gave this man the benefit of the doubt. Once that, once I seen the editor um, post a YouTube video on YouTube saying all this, his side about King Sid, and there was a part in there where he mentioned that Sid was telling him not to work with me while we were cool and stuff like that. Fam, I literally texted, I literally texted Sid and I said, I'm like, bro, what this, what this shit about? This man talking about some, I ain't got to explain myself to nobody, you know what I'm saying? I ain't got to say shit. Doesn't that just sound like a cap ass nigga, like a nigga that's just lying, bro? You know what I'm saying? Like, explain yourself. You know what I'm saying? Like, and then you you get mad at me because I'm 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 explaining myself now. I'm now I'm out here talking. You know what I'm saying? I have every right to talk. This is YouTube. If my name gets brought up in the situation, I can talk about it. You know what I'm saying? So that shit, like you moving slimy, bro. Like I even, I, I'm not just on here like, oh, I heard the editor say this, and and I'm gonna just hop on the hate train. Like, nah, bro. You know what I'm saying? I, I clarify, clarify what you are clarify. The editor, editor said you cap what? You capping? And then when I ask you, you made it seem like you was capping. So stop the cap, my boy. He said. Yes, I did say that when we weren't cool. Plus, why the fuck would I want someone on my team working with someone I don't fuck with? <sighs> Fam, I have receipts. Receipts. I ain't talking about Walmart, nigga. I got receipts of you saying that you was you didn't want the editor working with me. You know what I'm saying? And while we were cool, I was never using the editor before we were cool. So that don't even make sense. How you gonna tell the editor not to edit for me? And I, I wasn't even using the editor or even try to work with the editor before we was cool. You sound dumb as hell, boy. And then it says, if you still had animosity after the fight you lost, you should have never been cool with me again. Plus the editor deleted both vids because he know he was lying. Um, fam, I'm gonna be honest. I have no animosity towards you at all, my boy. You know what I'm saying? This shit happened years ago. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna let you know something, buddy. You're not like that. You're not like, I pulled up Olo, my boy. You pulled up with eight niggas to my house. You know what I'm saying? I still came out there and squabble, squabble. You know what I'm saying? So let me tell you something. You won't do the same thing. Sin will not do the same thing. If I pulled up to your house with eight, nine niggas and you was Olo, you not coming out the crib, boy. Is you crazy? Everything this man do, he has to do it with a bunch of people. He can never move alone. He can't move with one guy. He just he just fumbles. He, he doesn't know how to do that. He's not an independent guy. You might be, well, let me let me not say it. he's independent when it comes to like work and shit like that, but as far as living anything like that, the man has to surround himself with all these people. That's why you get yourself into fucked up situations. Because you want to surround yourself with so many fucking people. You know what I'm saying? Like I was saying though, you pull up to my crib, eight, nine niggas. I'm by myself. I did my thing. I pulled up no camera, nigga. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a real G. Regardless of anything, win or lose, nigga, I'm a real G. And I'm going to stand on that. You know what I'm saying? Straight up. Nigga talking crazy, nigga. You know what I'm saying? You trying to, nigga, I'm a squabble. I'm a squabble. You know what I'm saying? I don't have any animosity towards you at all. Nigga, I got back cool with you. I'm thinking shit cool. You know what I'm saying? We squash all that shit. But you still acting like a lame ass nigga. And that shit, I, ugh. I can't. And then he said the editor deleted deleted both videos because he knew he was lying. Let me tell you something. The editor actually did delete the videos, but it wasn't because um, he was lying. It was really because that he mentioned Avery B in the video and he worked with Avery B. He was originally working with Avery B and Avery B and his team said, hey, yo, take those videos down. We don't want we don't want Avery name associated with it. The editor literally told me this. So that's why the editor deleted it. He didn't delete it because he was lying, my boy. You thought you had one. You did it. Fuck, boy. Anyway, now he goes on about that. He said, Diamond, I don't know why you talking. Um, our beef ended when we was on the cruise and fuck. Oh. Hey, chill out now. He said... 
uh, our beef ended when we was on a cruise, sexing and don't act like a victim the whole time we've been cool. Look, bro, there's there's been countless amount of times where there's been women that had to deal with an abusive relationship or a fucked up relationship and they still link back up with that guy. Just because she linked back up with you doesn't mean you didn't hit her. It doesn't mean you didn't do the things that you did. Fam, you're still guilty. You know what I'm saying? You're not... you. I, I've gotten through three people right now and you ain't addressed shit that you've been called out for, buddy. But I'm bull. My nigga, go to Chicago because you're bull. And then it says, Kenzie, you need to just disappear. I don't even know why you're talking. You was blowing up my phone trying to see me and I didn't answer you. You're just mad. I said I used, I used you to get over my ex. And what kind of, what kind of nigga... Uses a that's some female shit. I hey, don't bite, don't don't kill the messenger. I'm just saying that's some that's some female shit. You know what I'm saying? I, I don't, I ain't, I ain't, I ain't, I ain't, I ain't got no parts of that. Um, you're just mad. I said I use you to get over my ex. Blah, 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 blah. Um, before you dropped that video saying you miss me, you was homeless and I took you in. Don't forget your car was about to get repoed and I paid for it. Bam. You trying to get on the girl, you said she homeless. Fam, how does that make you look? You took a homeless bitch in your crib. And you had her living there for months. Look how bogus you sound, buddy. You sound bogus. You look, he literally just said, I took, I, I took you, you were homeless. I took you in. Nigga, is your house a shelter? A fucking group home. That's what I like to call it. Fucking group home. Taking homeless motherfuckers in. What kind of shit is that? Fam, that's on you. You can't blame this girl for that. This girl came in off a two-man, fam. A two-man. You cuffed a two-man, fam. It's like me coming with my dog. I, I mean, me, me at the crib with one of my dogs. And then two girls come. One of them for me. One of them for my dog. And then the one that's for me end up switching to my dog. And then my dog end up greasing and end up cuffing that bitch. I'm gonna look at him crap and be like, you tripping, fam. And ain't no way all this shit happened in the house and no one checked him. They had to. I know no, I know ain't nobody just let this man slide with all this bullshit. They had to have check him, but let me tell you something about Kings. He's not gonna listen to anybody. He never will. What King said, I said, said. What King said, nigga. Says goes and he's never wrong. That's just how he is. You know what I'm saying? Whatever he says goes and it's right. It's 100% all the time and you must listen. You must bow down. Bitch, you got me fucked up. I ain't bowing down to shit, nigga. Let me see. Suave, I know you mad about that too, man. But look, you got my leftovers. Plus, you ain't even living that crib, so zip it. I mean... Leftovers? Too mad? Hmm. I'm just gonna skip past that one. Call a kid. You do anything for money. You look like a. You're like a lost soul. I used to fuck with you. I tried to take you under my wing and put you out there without taking any money from you. And I'm still shocked how you crossed up. First of all, you try to take Call a kid under your wing. Look! Look how he sounds. You know, Call a kid already had over 100k subs, probably over 200k subs before you met him. You tried to bring Kali Kid, part of your crew. You tried to clown him for 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 views. Not to make it look for you. Tried to clown the man. You knew exactly what you were doing. Tried to clown that man. You know what I'm saying? And then try to make it seem like you putting him on. The man was already had over 100, 200 k subscribers already, fam. You didn't put you didn't put no one on. You didn't you didn't take someone from zero from egg zero and 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 bring him up there like that. I mean, besides Jay Wonder, because he gonna you know what I'm saying. But we ain't gonna talk about that anyway. Um. I tried to take you in my wing, blah, 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 put you out there um, without taking any money for but you crossed up. It's all good, player. I should have been cut you off when you have, when, when you were secretly charging people 250 ahead to be in my video. I've never in my life charged anyone to be in a video before, and you was doing this behind my back. Oh, and let's not talk about how you was trying to take 50% from your girl channel. I should have done that to you since I'm so fake. That, <sighs> help me. Help me, somebody! Fam, you still 
ain't talk about shit that it happened. Like, what does this have to... Oh, boy, you need medical help. You need medical help, buddy. <sighs> to be... And you was doing... Behind my... And let's not talk about how you was trying to take 50... Anyways. Lil' Jeff. I spit on your ass because you, you had no business to ever get involved. I never spoke bad on you. I never talked to you in the wrong way. And you just came out of nowhere talking crazy to me. But I should have never done that. It was just too much rage in the moment. Plus, I just finished fighting Nate. Fam, what gives you the right to spit at your homeboy for because you were in rage? Because you couldn't control your emotions. He's literally, uh, 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 what's the word for it? Um... I don't fucking know. But he basically, he's basically snitching on himself. You know what I'm saying? He's snitching on himself. He literally said, Jeff, I spit on you. Sorry, my fault. I couldn't control my emotions. Nigga, you gonna spit on the day one because y'all was talking whatever the fuck? Come on, bro. Who, who spits on? Like, are you? Y'all look at me, y'all. You know I fought with y'all. How would y'all feel if I spit on y'all? How would your friend feel if you spit on them or if they spit on you? How would you feel? That shit's not cool, buddy. Spitting on people, fam. You spit on the ground. You spit on fucking on garbage. You gonna spit in someone's face, my boy? Just cause he came to check you because you and Jay Wonder jumped Nate? Of course, that's some real nigga shit. Jeff came and he tried to, you know what I'm saying, stick up for Nate cause he got jumped. If niggas gonna fight, it's gonna be one on one. You know what I'm saying? All that jumping shit. You trying to hit niggas in the back of the head? Get off of sin. Get off of sin. Get off of sin. Fam, Jeff has every right to come and stand up for Nate because it's just like, yo, y'all supposed to be running once. Jay, one of you jumping in? Of course, Jeff can jump in, bro. He has every right to jump in. That's his dog. What? You just gonna sit there and let your y'all? You gonna let your dog get jumped? I thought so. So that's what I'm saying, like, bro, what, what, what is this, bro? Flex God, ha, 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 you're, 30, you're 32 years old, my boy, hang it up. Um, if y'all don't know who Flex God is, Flex God is someone who, um, he was around us, you know what I'm saying? He, he knew Sid from when Sid was, like, a jit you know what I'm saying? So Flex God been there through everything, he's seen everything. I've actually watched Flex God video. He actually apologized to me in his video for everything that had happened, because I actually did cut off Flex God, because he was... One of the people that came with Sid to my house to come fight, you know what I'm saying, a couple years ago. And he was actually the one that was recording the camera for Sid, you know. So he apologized in the video. I had cut him off, you know what I'm saying. But and I'm saying we straight now. He apologized, everything like that. He was just basically saying everything was in the heat of the moment. They even told Sid not to post it on YouTube. But Sid was just like, man, fuck it. No, I'm posting it on YouTube. I'm posting this fight on YouTube, blah, 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 blah. Gio, if Gio uh, whooped my ass, he would post it on YouTube. I didn't even go out there with no cameras to fight you, my boy. That shit, like, when it comes to certain shit, certain more, certain type of respect, shit like that, like, there's boundaries to this shit, which you don't have, which you don't know, which you don't understand. And that's why you need help. You dig what I'm saying? But shout out to Flex God. He apologized. We cool. Ain't no bad blood. Um, and then he said, but nah, y'all was trying to size me, use that TikTok challenge pick to make me look gay. And blah, blah, blah. No one ever called you gay. No, no one ever tried to make you look gay, fam. Someone just, Nate just pulled up a picture of you with a dress. Nigga, you were on the internet with a dress. You know what I'm saying? Doing, nigga, blame yourself, goddammit. You know what I'm saying? He pulled that up. You can't get mad at him for that. You know what I'm saying? He, he, was, he was, hey, hey, that ain't got nothing to do with me. You know what I'm saying? And, and that, and they not even trying to tell y'all a story. They just trying to come up off some holiday money. Because why y'all dropping so much videos? We dropping videos because we got to address this shit. You know what I'm saying? It's a lot of shit that, like, he'll try to put over people's heads. No, like, we have to let y'all know. Because he going to try to manipulate y'all. He going to try to, you know what I'm saying, work his <sighs> little, you know what I'm saying, his little shit on y'all. You know what I'm saying? So we got to let y'all know. Y'all got to be open to this shit. I'm glad a lot of y'all is realizing a lot of this bogusness that's going on with bruh. And seeing bruh for who he really is and who what his true colors is. I'm glad y'all finally seeing it now. But we have to keep dropping because y'all got to see this shit. Because if we don't, if, we, if, if, if it was just one video out, everybody just be like, eh. You know what I'm saying? But everyone is coming out letting they know because they feel like no one had a... a uh, his ex-girlfriend can't come 
and make if y'all if y'all want me to his ex girlfriend actually dropped a um a little video talking about him. So if y'all want me to react to that too, y'all just let me know. But anyway, um, everyone like for example, his ex girlfriend. She can't speak out on you because she doesn't have a platform. No one's going to listen to her. Everyone's going to call her bogus the same way had how they did with Diamond. They are calling her bogus. And Diamond actually has a platform. So these people cannot, you know what I'm saying, speak their voice, let their voice be heard because they have no platform. People going to think they're capping. So when this all coming out and people saying what they got to say, it's like it's finally getting the attention that it deserves because if they were to do it any other time, no one would believe them. But now people are finally getting able, being able to express themselves, express like the truth, you know what I'm saying, and let you know what's up with this man, cause he needs help. But um, let's get him back to it. I'm sorry about that, y'all. Twelve hundred for rent each month, this. and then tell y'all I was paying twenty five hundred. The total amount each month was eight eighty five hundred. Hold on now, but there was five people in the house. Hold on now. Oh, and he, oh, I didn't even see this. And he said, and y'all know I knocked down more. I knock down more bitches than all y'all. You don't. <laughs> you don't. No. Hell no. This is irrelevant. This is very irrelevant. Like I said, he's not talking about anything. But let me make this clear, my boy. You probably out of his whole crew, me, anybody, probably you bag the least, buddy. I'm not going to lie. Uh, if y'all know me, you know what I'm saying? Y'all know I mess with quality women. You know what I'm saying? If y'all go to my channel, y'all see anybody I dated, y'all know Gio go mess with some quality women for sure. You know what I'm saying? You, my boy, you mess with foot draggers, stragglers. The, like, the girls you mess with, anybody can hit, fam. You know what I'm saying? And mind you, you don't even mean hitting most of the time. You know what I'm saying? Bitch is not fucking with you in the city, my boy. Humble yourself. Do the math. Twelve hundred times five is six thousand. What is this? Let me see. Now he talking about the he talking about the contract to move in. This is kind of irrelevant. I'm not. This has nothing to do with anything that's been going on. Uh. Show me some, honey. Let me see. Oh, go ahead. I ain't, I ain't tripping. Collect, collect your money, bro. Collect, collect, collect your little ass money. I, I got you, bro. You know what I'm saying? Uh, this is irrelevant. They just talking about the rent right here. Um, I says now, Geo. This is the gla now, Geo. This is the glazing ass editor I fired because he couldn't get none of my videos done, and he emailed me trying to work with me again. Guess that didn't work, so he spread lies. <clears throat> this screenshot is irrelevant, my boy. November 24th, 2022. But in 2023, you were using the editor. So what are you talking about? And I was using the editor as well. And we got back cool and you told him to stop working for me. Him saying, hey, bro, I don't want to do say thing. Him saying that he want to work with you again has nothing to do with the situation. How many times I have to say this? What's wrong with you, buddy? Oh my gosh, man. This, this screenshot is irrelevant. What is this? Someone take his phone. Someone take it. Someone, y'all gotta take this man's phone, boy. Blazing editor I fired, couldn't get oh my, my bitch done. Then he emailed me trying to work with me again. Gosh, that ain't the real. It meant a lot. Just the fact you gave me this opportunity meant a lot to me. I'm not trying to be friends or anything like that, but I really don't need anything. Uh -huh. I just wanted to pause and say thank you. Keep going and hit that millions or so. I was proud of you. Um, bro, I mean, like, they How said, is this? this is Kenzie texting my sister. Then this is Kenzie texting my sister. If y'all don't know, Kenzie is uh, his ex or whatever, his most recent ex. And shit like that. The fact that they all had something negative to say about, huh? And why you still texting my sister if I abused you? What? What does your ex girlfriend texting your sister have? Am I? Y'all, y'all see it. Y'all, y'all, y'all see it for yourself. You know what I'm saying? Am I? Am I tweaking? Is there anything in here where he says he didn't hit me? I don't know if he really backed me up though. He made me kind of sound dumb. Like I was just there to get over his ass and I stayed over there. It's not like I don't know. This shit is irrelevant, homie. What is this? 
And so it said she was. This man still ain't talking about nothing that happened. So long ago, I'm about to spaz out, woman. I'm about to spaz. They all had something negative to say about me, like they want to. But... Oh, don't tell me I have to keep skipping because he's not talking about shit. Y'all got me fucked up. All y'all trying to cancel me, knowing damn well I put y'all in positions. Hold on there, buddy. Put who in position? Because damn sure ain't me, my boy. I put you in position. You know what I'm saying? To kickstart your career. And you're here now. Um, you're fucking it up for yourself. Uh, I really wanted the best for you. You know what I'm saying? But you're just... You let that shit go to your head, gang. It's just... Wow. Okay. And get off my dick telling me why I'm posting this kick because y'all got me fed up spreading all these lies. Y'all trying to make me seem like I was so evil. Why the fuck y'all ain't say nothing to me then? Fam, the shit that you've been doing, the stuff you've been doing all this time, bro, it, it, it's evil, bro. It's, it, it's really evil, gang. I, I'm not going to hold you, bro. It's really evil, bro. You are evil, bro. Look at everything you're doing, everything you're causing, everything like that, fam. Trying to make me seem like I was... The people, the reason why people not in this, some people, I'm gonna let you know. Anytime Sid has ever done some fuck shit, I, I let him know. On site, I let him know what's up. He, and that's just not for him. That's for any of my dogs. They, they doing something, I'm gonna let you know what's up. I'm just, I'm gonna tell you what it is. I ain't gonna sugarcoat with you. I'm, I'm gonna be blunt and I'm gonna be straightforward with you. You feel me? Um, no, some of these guys that's in your circle, they're not gonna say nothing to you then because they feel like, you know what I'm saying? You the breadwinner right now, you know what I'm saying? They don't want to fuck, they don't want to, especially how you are, where someone could tell you something, someone could tell this man says something, and he'll be just like, bro, what the fuck, what are you tripping, what you got me fucked up? Like, he'll get mad if you try to check him about his stuff, because he, he's done with me, like, I checked him about some shit before, and he thought I was bogus, you know what I'm saying? He thought I was tripping, you know what I'm saying? But I'm going to let you know what it is. A lot of these, a lot of people in his circle, or used to be in his circle, they're not going to tell him what's up or nothing like that, because... One, he's not gonna listen. Two, he might cut them off. They might feel like, damn, like I don't got, you know what I'm saying, no like help, you know, none of, nothing like that and shit. And you know what I'm saying? So I, I understand, but when you keep doing it, doing it, doing it, doing it, bro, they're gonna speak out eventually, gang. You can't just be, you can't just keep stabbing the bear and not expect that nigga to, ah, yo ass. You feel me? he gonna get you sometime, bro, one way or another. You feel me? You got me fucked up. All y'all trying to cancel me knowing damn well I put y'all in positions. Y'all like little kids. As soon as daddy stops feeding y'all, y'all go to crying. And you get off my dick telling me why I'm posting this. Because y'all got me fed up spreading all these lies. Y'all trying to... Two niggas that started before and then this, me. This is the next lie right here. He said, two niggas that started before me. Y'all just mad because I passed y'all. And Gio, you was just at my house the other day. You ain't even try to hear none out. You was just ready to hop on that train. I know you hate to see me doing good without you. Fam, I don't hate you. I don't. I, I was never hating on you at all, gang. If anything, you was hating on me. You know what I'm saying? Like, I, I took you under my wing. I, I kick-started your shit. You know what I'm saying? How can I hate on a nigga when I literally, like, had you in my videos? I had all your social media links. When, when I was at the most buzzing time, when I first blew up, hitting a mill every video, mill every video, you know what I'm saying? And I'm putting all your socials in all of my videos, I'm helping you, nigga, I never hated on you, ever. You know what I'm saying? I looked out for you since day one, you feel me? And I hate to see it, I hate to see him doing good without me, fam, it's, it's you, see, you might be thinking like that, because you're that type of nigga. I'm not thinking like that at all, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm, I'm happy for niggas to do good. You know what I'm saying? Everyone around me, they doing good. It's that's that's good. I love seeing people around me doing good. Cause let me tell you something, y'all. Now this is some real game right here. So why would you want everyone around your circle doing bad? It's just gonna make you bad. It's gonna make you go. <laughs> you feel me? When everyone in your circle is doing good, it's gonna make you do good. It's gonna make you go up. You know what I'm saying? Cause everybody in your circle doing good, you doing good. Y'all all can help each other. Y'all all can, you know what I'm saying, support, help each other, get people to a higher place. You know what I'm saying? Get get the higher, higher, uh, higher up in life, higher up in your career. So I would never want to see anyone around me like doing bad. You know what I'm saying? And you saying this nigga, I'm I'm the nigga who created your YouTube channel. How can I be hating on you, buddy? Why would I hate? This is this is ballistic. 
I'm appalled. I'm flabbergasted. And and back on what I was saying, he said I wasn't trying to hear nothing out. Him, I literally texted you before I even spoke up, spoke out about any of this shit that's going on. I texted you about it. I did all this and that. Now after when I speak out on it, you know what I'm saying? When I tried to, when I tried to talk to you at first about everything, you was like, I ain't gotta explain myself. Nah, nah, I ain't got nothing to tell you, bro. Handle that. You know what I'm saying? I ain't got nothing to tell you. That's how you was acting. Now when I speak out about the situation, now you wanna try and call me. After. When I tried to clear it up at first, now after I'm talking about it, now you wanna shoot me a call. No, bro. I'm good, bro. I tried to talk to you about it before. You you brushed me off. You 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 was capping about the whole shit. Now now that I dropped a video on it, now I'm the problem. Now now I now I'm hopping on the eight train. Hell no. Nah, what you mean? Good without you. Dang, I ain't gonna lie, shit. You are crazy, bro. Like hey. he made you like. What are you talking about? Yeah, of course they did it before Thank you. you. And that's why you begged for them to put you on. Hey, who is it? Shoot you a little light for that. I ain't gonna cap, please. Bad boy, spend some real shit, boy. I ain't gonna lie. Then it says, Suave, look, cut. You might as well let go of that two man. We already switched player. And I ain't gonna lie. I don't know who this girl is. If y'all know who this girl is in the comments, let me know. But I'm assuming this is the one of the swaps off of Suave and, and the two man. So, I mean. Nah, this. This ain't this ain't this ain't the swap this ain't the two man swap that they had. I actually know who this is. He's this is this is some other girl swap they mess with whatever. Woo, 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 woo. That that has nothing to do with the two man. That this is irrelevant. I don't know why he posted this. This is just this has nothing to do with anything. Why are you posting this? Why are you posting shorty? She she had nothing to do with this whole drama mess shit. Like why? Now now. But, now bitches in the city, they, I mean, they, they, it wasn't really even fucking with you to begin with like that. Now, now, now girls in the city is really scared of you now. You posting, bitch, you, you ever heard of no face, no case? Hey, you let it be known with this one, my boy. You gotta chill. That's kind of crazy. I ain't gonna lie. Look at this, like, this is unnecessary, bro. Then it says, it's unnecessary. Hold on, my computer about to die. Hold on, wait a minute. Oh, shit. Hold on, 6%. Hold on, y'all. Let me go get that charger. Hold on now. Hold on now. And if y'all want me to be all the way real, I got the motivation for all of us to move in together from A and P. They're an amazing team, and the way they help each other and push each other was amazing to me. I tried my best to help all of us come together, and it wasn't working. So instead of me losing myself and continuing the drama that was happening, I removed myself with one month notice. I've been living alone for three months. And y'all want to come bother me on December so y'all can get y'all holiday pay. Plus, each one of them boys dropped two to three videos on King Shit. Like, what? It's not even pride. Like, how can I take accountability for shit that's not even true? It, it, it is pride, fam. It's like, you see, like, everything he does, he just doesn't see where he went wrong. He doesn't see how he's wrong. Like I said, he always think he right. You feel me? Not even, how can I take accountability for shits that's not true? Fam, when all these people, when all these girls saying you hit them, you know what I'm saying? We thought, we thought Diamond was lying at first. She, 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 apparently she wasn't lying, fam. You hit the second girl, the third girl. You hitting girls that you're not dating. You know what I'm saying? People are seeing it with their own eyes. You know what I'm saying? I've, I've been here to win. I've never been there. Um, when he's hit on women or whatever, but I've been here. I've been there for all the other fuck shit. Every other fuck shit, I, I've been there for that. And I, I seen, and I just know. So it's just like, bro. Yes, you got to take accountability, my boy. You should study that word for vocab class. You have a vocab class. Put shit in it and make them study accountability. Make them spell it. Make them spell the word accountability. Make them do the definition. Accountability. That's accountability. And yeah, you yeah. Bro, you got to take accountability for your for your actions, bro. You know what I'm saying? I know you don't want to be wrong, which you are wrong right now. And you don't want to admit to the fact. But you have to take accountability, bro. You have to take accountability for your actions. Yeah. How the fuck Diamond trying to hop on a train, too, when we hung out so much times? 
since we've been to core, you want to seem like a survivor so bad, just jump in the ocean and swim to the dock. I'm tired of this on and off shit like a light switch. Make up your mind. Fam, she's speaking out because no one, everyone ignored her when she tried to speak up in the beginning. Like I was saying, everyone, she had a platform. People were still blind to the fact. Now other people are going through the same situation that she went through. And now she feels like, damn, now I can probably speak out about this again because more people like, there's girls that's gone through the same thing that I went through and I got to talk about it. You know what I'm saying? Like, it don't I'm matter if y'all hung out again, bro. You know how many times there's been fucked up relationships and shit and the girl go back to the guy or something? Bro, it, it, it's fucked up, bro. Like, this this is irrelevant, bro. Wow, wow, that's crazy. How the fuck Diamond trying to hop on the train too when we hung out so much time since we've been to court? Yeah. Niggas that be finding any reason to talk Cause you niggas got passed And you niggas wanna catch back up Don't do that Try ass hating that shit Nigga you was just at my house Like a week ago Trying to make me promote a clothing brand Oh he's talking about me <laughs> He's talking about me here <laughs> Your team talking about me Yeah that's about me He he sending You sending slick shots about me With your dick out in the shower Stop it Put your dick away my boy You could've did this in the goddamn living room Cuz in somewhere in the shower with your dick out? Boy, you crazy, boy. Yes, I did come to his house. I did drop off a package and I banged it. You know what I'm saying? Like, I wasn't chilling with you, buddy. You know what I'm saying? I came on some business shit. I, I dropped off my boy's clothing, play Benji, you know what I'm saying? And I, I went on about my business, you know what I'm saying? And then I find out this fuck shit a week later. Like, what? to talk about it let's talk about it but this man in the shower with his goddamn wiener out and I'm mad because you passed me bro I'm not I'm not mad about any of that fam if I wanted to surpass you or do it whatever bro I could, if I really wanted to bow down and do fam I done did this shit before I can do it again my boy don't make me go there. Don't make me go there, buddy. We we can we Alright. It's like what the fuck, nigga? Come on, bruh. Stop all that dick sucking. You niggas don't know what side to pick on. The fuck? Maybe if you make the wrong side, you can stay on that side, bitch. That's why I Oh, I'm on my side. You see I'm on my side. I'm on my side. You know what I'm saying? It ain't about no choosing sides. It, but fam, you're a fucked up individual that needs help. Go seek that, buddy. I'm not here to choose sides. I'm not here to hate on you. Fuck up your bag. I tried to be there to help you create a bag. How can I try to fuck up your bag? Shit ain't about no sides. You want to talk about sides? Shit ain't about no size, bro. This shit is about real shit. Your fucked up actions. That got us, got that, that, that got us here. Now you're in the shower with your dick out. Spazzing. You're screaming at the camera. What has gotten into you? You are guilty, my boy. Fam, you... Wait, what is that? Fam, no one's trying to make you get canceled at all. We just letting the audience know what it is and what it ain't. You know what I'm saying? Y'all want to know, right? Exactly. We letting y'all know what it is and what it ain't. You know what I'm saying? And right now, this 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 what it is right now. And he got his dick out in the shower. I don't know what the fuck he got going on. But no, bro. But like, what is this, fam? Take accountability. Apologize to everyone that you fucked up and screwed over. And and bit in the ass. And go about your business, bro. Shit could have been sweet, bro. Like he 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 went on. He said he wasn't talking about it. He wasn't talking about it. He he thought this shit was gonna blow over. But now they're biting him in the ass. Yeah.
They're going to get you, my boy. Now, now he wants to spaz out. He's crashing out right now. I don't know what this is. He ran in on the store. He's he crashing out right now. He's, he's going through it. He's miserable. But, fam, you got yourself here, fam. You got yourself in this position. Like, you can't blame me for that. That's posting shit about me that's not true. So I'm going to apologize to y'all for what they said. I'm not trying to make y'all think... I'm that person. I apologize to y'all. Why the fuck you apologizing to us? Come on, bro. Then I go to post a receipt. Now some of y'all dick sucking ass niggas like, why the fuck you posting? This is too much info. This and that. Nigga, what the fuck? Bitch, I want to know this shit. The fuck? Dang, bro. Calm down. Calm the fuck. Someone, calm down, buddy. I invest, I invest over 100k in four months on my- WHAT THE FUCK DOES THIS HAVE TO DO WITH ANYTHING?! WHAT DOES THIS HAVE TO DO WITH ANYTHING?! You're a hot mess. You're a hot fucking mess. Y'all really got shit. Y'all got shit going crazy, whoa. He, he got, got going shit going crazy, crazy whoa. He taking a shower going crazy, whoa. Why y'all doing this to getting shit, whoa? He tripping, whoa. He in the shower going crazy, whoa. He got it, he got He really is in the shower. You would think someone in the shower would be in there clearing their motherfucking thoughts. And you would think a light bulb would go off. Ding, ding, ding. Trying to tell y'all. Maybe my fans are saying... Like, well, you're, you, by your own admission, your fans are literally telling you, why are you apologizing to us? And then you don't do what they say and apologize to other people and justify it by doing what your fans didn't want exactly. you to do. Exactly. Now he can't even, now he can't even drop an apology message to all of us because it's it not even going to make sense no more. Because you already spazzed out, you, you, you started crashing out, you started doing all... Bro, you could have just apologized to everyone, you took accountability, but no, you don't know accountability, and that's just that. Like I said, he need to go to the class, you know what I'm saying? Study accountability, about vocab word, that's gonna be a vocab word for the week, goddamn Accountability. Are you slow? Like, what is going on? Like, this is real life crazy. It, I, I think he's slow, y'all. He has he, to be. He, he might. Like, what's going on? He, like, he, is. he is. Because, he is. bro, that apology did nothing. You didn't apologize to the people you did wrong, and you're saying. I'm not apologizing to them Facts. because I didn't do them wrong when all of your fans are saying you did do them wrong. So unless you come out with some real, real receipts. And he ain't got none. Like, he ain't got no real receipts. Geo, Nate, it, it, these people in a lie, bro, you're raps. Like, it's raps, bro. So, again, he said, I invest over 100K in four months on my YouTube channel. This, this is really Y'all uh, trying to stop What me. is this? Wait, what did he say? But I do this shit for money. I could have been gave y'all whack content and just worry by myself. I ain't never need no one bread. How the fuck? Who said you? Who said you needed anyone's bread? Whack content and just worry about myself. I ain't never need no bread. How do, how you hating on me? Cause I'm trying to be better. <sighs> Boy, I was so close to three mil and boom. I was so close to three mil and boom. I lost twenty five k subs in a week. That shit's so flawed. But I'm gonna charge it again. Fam. Yeah. You lost those 25k subs yourself, fam. Clean up your mess, bro. Clean up your actions, bro. Like, people are probably seeing, like, I remember, I remember when we did this, this, this prank. Y'all remember that prank when it, it made it seem like I was, you know what I'm saying, doing it, what it do, you know what I'm saying, I was doing, doing what it do, you know what I'm saying, with Diamond. Bro, Sid playing that whole shit, bro. And what, what happened to me and Diamond, bro? Me and Diamond subscribers, bro, we lost more than 25k subs, bro. Our shit started, woo. But we just, you know what I'm saying, we just started getting back right. And that shit was all, it was fake, bro. It was, it was fucking fake, bro. It, it was, I don't even know why we did that, bro. You know what I'm saying? See, it was just like, yo, we should do this. It's going to boost it up. No, like, bro. And for those of y'all that's thinking this whole shit is, this shit not fake, bro. This shit is real. I know a lot of shit y'all see on YouTube be fake. And, no, this is real. But yeah, fam, now you see how I feel, you know what I'm saying? Losing 25k, so, hey, I'm surprised you didn't lose more, bro, because the shit you done did, my boy, is fucked up.
Boom, I lose 25K subs in a week. That's so flawed, but I'm going to charge it to the game. It's Kinsey. I know you not trying to hear from me, plus I'm blocked. You keep popping up in my mind, so I wanted to check on you and see if you're straight. I hate that stuff ended badly. If you see this, you can let me know. I actually seen this, uh, uh, I, I seen this story. A fan sent me this story, right, from, from Sid Pay when he posted it. And they were saying, oh, I tried contacting this number, and it was a fake number that he was texting himself. So if that's true, you're just, you're already bogus. I mean, you're just even bogus, sir. You know what I'm saying? Uh, you just, you've, you've crossed the line. You should, King Bogus, that's, yeah. That's like a King, yeah, that should be a thing. Um, no, if you're doing but, okay. Yeah, if you no was texting yourself this, you, but you I, got a problem. Uh, I'm sorry for reacting how I did when I texted you before, but just let me know if you're straight. That's crazy, but you want to post on your story. Everything's so direct, so I know you see my message. So, I guess he... Oh, yeah, and this is what I wanted to show y'all, but I had to go find it. Y'all need to file a police report. I ain't gonna lie. What he saying not cap, what, is it not cap, though. For all y'all girls that's letting him put uh, his hands on y'all, y'all need to go file a police report. Get him, get him gone. He needs re rehab a little rehabilitation. He rehab a little... Hey, re rehab, y'all know what I'm trying to say. You know what I'm saying? You, bruh, yeah, if y'all going through this, if any girl, if a future girlfriend that he had, if y'all go through this, just file a, get, file a report. Go, just go ahead and rap. Just go ahead and rap. We ain't gonna get on you. We ain't gonna call, we ain't gonna call you Gunner, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to Gunner, because I don't even think he a rap. But we ain't gonna call you that. We ain't, go, go rap, girl. You ain't no rat. Go, just go tell. Let it be known. Cause this, this is just getting out of hand, bro. But this is Kinsey, the per and she, the Kinsey made a video. I just didn't make a video on her. I might, uh, but uh, this is his ex. Yeah, uh, this, this is his ex girlfriend. The two men with the swap who was staying in the house for like long we after the time. This so this is, is her. Man. Like, I saw this video, but there's no date on this video. But it do look old as hell. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, this dude watch that video. Y'all hop on this damn live. At BXIS. What, is, what does this have to do with anything, bro? Nate gonna cap y'all saying Jay Wonder was a fan of him when I've been to him since 2016. Okay. Sid, you knew Jay Wonder since 2016. You never... I don't I don't know where this video's from, but I, I, I've been with Sid during these times. You, We've never hung out with Jay Wonder ever. Jay Wonder, like, yes, we knew of Jay Wonder. It was more so of a, like, we see him, like, yo, it was good, uh, 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 uh. We out the way, we gone. You know what I'm saying? It wasn't also, we never chilled with Jay Wonder. We never did nothing like that. We never hung out with Jay Wonder. But when me and Sid started beefing, Jay Wonder just came out. I don't know where the fuck he came from. I don't, I don't know. And then he just started dissing. I don't get You are a King Sid Glazer, my boy. I'm sorry to break it to you. Where did you come from? I, I, someone tell me where Jay Wonder came from. I don't know. Like I said, we knew him, you know what I'm saying? But now you, you got them, you like Robin Hood, my boy. Now, you you like, and mind you, Jay Wonder older than Sid. He, about, he pushing 30, you know what I'm saying? You pushing 30, you 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 looking up to a 23-year-old, whatever the fuck, you know what I'm saying? This, that's, I don't know what y'all got going on, but, yeah, bro. This is, this is irrelevant, man. This ain't D-X-I-S-C. Everybody's saying J Wonder a D writer because y'all y'all go ahead and handle that ad man. I'm gonna go ahead and, and try and wrap this video up for y'all because my camera dying and stuff like that. But let's just let's go. The video almost done, so let's just go ahead and try and see what's up. Everybody's saying J Wonder a D writer because he ain't switching up. Fam, J Wonder not switching up because he ain't got nothing if you ain't there. If J Wonder leave you right now, he's gonna go back to where he fucking came from. I don't know where. Fucking boo hoo fuck. I, I don't know where, where, where I don't know where he came from. You know what I'm saying? That's why. Of course he gonna stick by your side, my boy. He, he ain't had nothing going on before, so of course he gonna. If he which you you basically you y'all backbone. You know what I'm saying? Backbone. What is it? TSS, my favorite girl. T my favorite girl. Only girl stays stop. Oh, brother. So Stop. you can really see he has nobody in I his circle you. right now. Beard you, he don't spot. got nobody in his circle, bro, because he's just sliding so many people out, bro. 
What is this? I don't care. Y'all love my. I, I know you love Jay Woody. Y'all got some shit going on. I don't know what that shit is about. But I, but I think that's it. I think that's it for the video. You know what I'm saying? If y'all stayed until the end, I love y'all so much. If you're new to the channel, subscribe. Hit that like button. You know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna lie. I might. I might react to. To some of this other stuff from these other people that, that what they've been saying, you know, of course not no random people, but everybody that's a part of this whole thing, I might react to see what's going on because it's a lot of tea that we got to see, you know what I'm saying? So y'all make sure y'all stay tuned. It's your boy, Smoke Jam, and I'm gone, you did.